Hey everybody, NessieB here. Welcome back to more Mother 3. In the last episode, wow, Boney only has 3 HP. We fought a really hard boss that was completely optional. You could lose if you wanted to, and you'd win. Uh, in this episode, we have the ultimate Chimera on the loose. And if it like, like I've already said it three, three or four times, if it makes contact with you, you do not fight it. It just kills you instantly. Okay? With that in mind, let us proceed cautiously. I can hear it. It could be down this corridor. Maybe. I can't believe I got assigned to this post. I'm just gonna proceed slowly one step at a time because if I see it, I'm going to run like heck. Ugh, there's a dead. Is it? Is it? Is it dead? I should have had. I should have had one of those extra rice balls this morning. Ugh. I can hear it. It's breathing. Ooh. Let's just hope it's not sneaking around in it. Okay, it's not in here. Good. Because it can be sneaking around inside a room that when you open that door you see it. Yes? It's just an old man. Yeah, I'd be hiding in here too, Gramps, if uh, there was a big, ugly, red-headed thing. Oh wow, I glitched my way out of the pool right there. I'd be, uh... If, I was, if there was a big red-headed monster out there, I think I'd be hiding in the hot spring too. Uh, it could be waiting right in the next turn. Oh, there's nothing out here. Okay. Oh my man, this is nerve nerving. When that red one's in the hallway, you gotta hit hide in the elevator or room until it passes. I knew all about that, and yet, man, I'm so stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Ow. Oh. Uh, man, this. Is Okay, it's not in this. It's not in this corridor. All right, where am I supposed to go? I'm gonna say the third floor. What's over here? Oh! Ah! It's right there! Did you see it? Did you see it? Yes, that's what it looks like. And it gave me nightmares for two nights. I don't know if it was in a row or not, but it gave me nightmares for two nights. You wanna see it again? There it is! Okay, you saw it. Very scary, indeed. Oh man, this is freaking me out. Oh, it's been in here. Sounds like it's changed rooms. Okay, here's the plan. I escape into a room when the red one is waiting outside. But if he's already standing in front of the room I want to go in, I make a bad dash for the next room over instead. Brilliant! I'm so smart! I can't believe how smart I am. Ow. Oink. Oh great, I hope he's not standing in the hallway, otherwise we're completely cut off. Oink. Oh, uh, man. Okay. Yipes! He's right there! Oh no! Oh man, please change rooms! Please! Ah! At least you're getting a lot of close encounter sights with him, aren't you? I'm gonna have to make a dash for it. I wonder if I can... I wonder if I can do it. Oh man, this is unnerving. Alright. We're gonna make a dash for it, okay? We're gonna do it. As soon as I... Uh... Oh boy. Oh man, what am I so scared about? It's not like it's in real life, but still. You know, I had a dream about it once. It, uh, well, I had a dream about it two times. It bit my arm. I was at a campground. And it bit my, it was going around killing people. And it came around to me and bit my arm. And it somehow miraculously only did half my health instead of full health. And I was able to get away somehow, run away, and use PK life up, and I was okay. But, ugh. Man, in real life, that wouldn't happen. Yikes! It's still there! Oh no! I'm completely boxed in. Oh man, this is not good. Oh boy, what do I do? Do I run, or do I wait for it to change rooms? If it'll actually change rooms... I'm gonna make a dash for it! Yay! I made it! I made it! I made it! I made it. Oh, I made it. And it just changed rooms. 
Yikes, it's following me! Oh, it changed rooms again? Come on! It changed rooms again! You hear when you, that door thingy closes? That means it's changing your room. Uh, this is completely unnerving. Okay, it's not in here. Oh, it's probably right behind me, too. Uh, no, you cannot interest me in some. I was just wanting to see if you'd say anything. Can we leave? Hey, you guys. Where do you think you're going? You're on the job. Hey, I'm a kid. I'm, you're not supposed to do this to me. I'm... Isn't that... Ugh. It's not in here. Uh, hmm. Let's head in the main building. I don't see it. Let us move on. You know, it'd be neat to see, uh... Steve Irwin do something like this if he wasn't dead already. Let's see. The exit is to the south, I think. And there's an elevator in this room. And to the west is the oppo is the oppressing room. Opportunity opening room? room. You know, the room where they do surgery. Actually, come to think of it, those monkeys fled into the basement earlier. How do you get into the basement? Who is this guy? In the trash can. Dr. Andonuts? I realize you haven't asked, but my name is Dr. Andonuts. I'm being forced to conduct various sorts of research by a certain man. Currently, though, I'm trying to conceal myself for certain reasons. I'm a bit preoccupied at the moment. Could you come back at a later time? No problem here. No problem here. Just leave it at that, would you? So apparently he got here from Mother 2 somehow. I wonder what's... I'm not going to find out. Um, I'll write it to the... Oh, of course I cannot write it to the second floor. Is there any more elevators? Uh... Uh... I guess we'll find out. Uh, looks like there's an elevator on the far end. I hope I don't walk straight into its jaws. Okay. This one takes you to the basement. Monkeys? Yeah, I ran some ran through the store actually. Why don't I run why don't I run after them, you ask? Ow, ow, ow! My stomach, it pains me so. Yeah, that ultimate chimera or chimera or whatever it's called. It made quick work I'd make quick work of it, if only it weren't for my aching stomach. Like they like they say, you can't fight on an aching stomach. So I leave the rest to you. See ya! Coward. I hope he runs straight into the mouth of that Camaro too. Basement one, let's go. Let's hope that let's hope that Camaro's not smart enough to figure out elevator controls. Okay. What do you have to say? For part timers, you sure do hard work. You sure do work hard. You're really something. But you should probably get out of this building as fast as you can. I tried to, but that jerk at the guard door tried to... Ooh, what's this? Got some pork stew. The monkey, it let the red one out of its cage. We're done for now. I put some rice balls in the freezer room, but they wound up frozen solid. I should have eaten them sooner. So they don't have containment protocols if it is, if I like that ultimate chimera escapes, like they don't have a bulkhead that seals off or something. Okay. They said they were in the basement. Aha! There you are! You're the ones causing all the trouble! I'm, what? They just... How'd they do that? Did they just, like, cheat? They cheated! Because you can't... That thing goes up to the ceiling! Eh, yeah, whatever. Okay, probably not gonna be, gonna be running right now, but... Uh, let's head back up to the first floor. On next. Maybe the third floor? Let's check the third floor. Well, I don't think there's anything on this. Yikes! Oh, it's right there. It's trying to get through. Let's get out of here. Oh, there they are. And they ran this way. Okay. Uh, hmm. I wonder. Should we head into here? I wonder if 
there's anything here. There's nothing here. Okay. As long as that ultimate chimera is out of range, I'm happy. Let's just head as far left as we can. I think they'll be they'll be at the farthest left corridor. Yep, there they are. You're cornered now. Oh great, guess who? Now we're cornered. The ultimate chimera, I presume. Hey, did I ever see how good that tail looks on you? I just remembered this Chimera's weakness, so I mustered up the courage to come here. Oh, that was close. And I like how those... This is a high-tech, battery-operated Chimera. In other words, if we push, if we set the power switch on the on its back to off, it will stop. Be my guest, Dr. Rananuts, be my guest. You're not getting me near that thing. Apparently when monkeys remember they can't hear sound and they see in black and white. Oh, great. There's a large button on its back. You need to press it. Come now. Be courageous. Do it yourself, Gramps. Use the dog as bait. Oh, you made Moni mad. It's approaching. And let's also save the day at the last possible second. That was close. Oh. Thank you, lad and monkey. I think I'll use this opportunity to leave the military and devote my life to making all living things happy. Oh. You agree with my idea? Thank you, dog. Uh, I'm sorry. I was merely joking about the bait thing. It's a simple misunderstanding! You have it all wrong! So also join your party, the most worthless party member in the game. Not that I hate him or anything, it's just he has so much low stats. Dead never stay undead. Okay, let's follow Salsa because he seems to know something. And there's no trout attacking us this time. There's a door here. The dancing figures are depicted on it. We're in control of... Oh, we're in control of Salsa for the first time ever. Uh, just our, us, by ourselves. No idiot facade and... We're completely in control of ourselves now. Dot, dot, dot. Lucas is as silent as ever. Wonder if... I, I, I don't want to risk anything, but... It's not nice to ditch your friends. That's an awesome line. Whatever. Okay.
be nice if I could open doors just by dancing in front of them. Like, why can't we just, like, gone around that, though? I mean, like, the, the cliff's not really not that steep. Let's go ahead and save up real quick. Because I'd really like to save. After going through that whole Camaro or ordeal, yeah. It'd be really nice not to be traumatized. And another pink shell. Oh, Kumatora! Finally found you. Whoa, awesome! You really did show up, Lucas. Oh, you're here too, Salsa? It's great to see you again. I don't know... I didn't know you were alive. Oh. And how have you been doing, Love Monkey? Hello. Stupid monkey. Oh my. Oh my. What adorable visitors. Introduce me to them, won't you? Yeah, sure. These are they're, they're, these are my friends. This is Salsa, the monkey and his love monkey. And this is Lucas, the human. And the dog is... Uh... Boney the dog! <laughs> so you're the sweet little Lucas. Ioni has told me so much about you. Come with me. I'll show you where the needle is. <laughs> oh yeah, almost forgot. Lucas. That's Storia, one of the seven mad gypsies. He, sa he saved me. Apparently that's what fate had in store. Okay, I better free up something real quick. Nah, I've got something free up, never mind. Okay, what do you have to say? I need to told me I don't need to told me you would come here. The needle I'm guarding is at the bottom of this pond. My needle is much more of a pain to pull out. Hee <laughs> It's hard to believe you really have the power to pull the needles. But before you can even try, we need to move the water from this pond into that empty hole first. You know the Chimera Laboratory to the west of here? There might be some junk that could help us out that, that could help us move the pond water. Why not why not look for something there? Okay, I'm gonna yeah, well, well, I guess we could cut. Yeah, why don't we just cut it here, okay? So if you like this part, like it, subscribe, and you're real for me on kind of videos. Let's keep these going. Okay, bye.